I want to offer a potential solution for students that struggle with reading. How are they going to read these hyperlinks? When they click on them, they jump to the page, and it can be a little bit uh, exasperating uh, for students that have difficulty staying on task. So I have a little friend up here in an extension called Copyfish. I'm going to select that, and I'm going to draw a little capture box around this first hyperlink. Do I want to read this or not? Copyfish does its work. And then I'm going to highlight it, and I'm going to read it using a free text reader called Speak It. Spencer Stone, airman who halted attack on train will attend State of the Union. So now from the student's perspective, they need to decide whether that's what they want to read or not. If they want to move on and so look at another one, they can select Recapture, highlight or, I'm sorry, draw another capture box. Let it do its work. Well, let's retry it again. Sometimes it does that. There we go. Highlight the text. Right click, read it. Looking back at Donald Trump's 2015. So you can see in this example, you've got a manner that you can use a free tool with another free tool to help a student read these hyperlinks. Give it a shot. I'd be curious to know what you think.